Callum here, and today I'm going to show you how to make a Paloma. But before we get into it, don't forget to like and subscribe to keep up to date with all of our new content. It is widely considered to be named after La Paloma, or The Dove, which was a very famous Mexican folk song from the 1860s. It is hard to say, however, who exactly created this cocktail. But one of the main stories goes that it was created in 1953 in La Capilla Bar by Don Javier Delgado Corona. This is the same man who created the very famous Batanga cocktail, so this is probably a likely story. The Paloma is very quickly becoming one of the most famous tequila cocktails in the world. With the margarita sat at the very top of that list, it's gonna be a very hard one to beat. It is already the most popular tequila cocktail in Mexico, which is a great sign for its popularity to come. The original Paloma recipe just calls for tequila and grapefruit soda. But we know that it's not internationally widely available grapefruit soda. So what we're going to do is a homemade version of the same. So what we're going to need to make this drink is some tequila, some lime juice, some grapefruit juice, a little bit of agave nectar, and some soda water to top it up with. We're gonna put the first four ingredients into our highball glass without ice first. We're gonna stir them round. Then we're gonna ice up and top with soda. We're gonna need 60 milliliters of tequila a good happy measure, 10 milliliters of agave nectar. Next up, we're gonna do 15 milliliters of lime juice. And we're gonna do 30 milliliters of grapefruit juice, freshly squeezed, of course. Now, we're gonna stir these ingredients, mix them round, ice and top up with soda, so. and top up, and we're gonna garnish this with a grapefruit slice. And there you go, a Paloma, enjoy.